Hi, this is Kevin with KGM Jam, owner of Pro Advertisers Club, a totally free site to advertise. Go to ProAdvertisersClub.com, join for free today and start advertising for free. And also, if you get a chance, go to eBay, type in KGM Jam, and check out my store. Please like and follow it. I'll be making videos on how my store is doing throughout the month. Okay, here we are in Immutable. I was introduced to Immutable through Vivi. Uh, VV was at the time on the Go chain and then um, transferred over to Immutable about a year ago, maybe two years ago. I don't know the exact date. They've been over there ever since. You you can find uh, on Immutable Scan, you can find the the buy and sell data on about VV, but nowhere else on the platform. So I don't know what the big deal is that they're not on the platform yet. Now they are a collecting app, no games on them as yet, so um, I don't know if they're waiting for the right time. Um, I just don't know. But anyway, what I wanted to show you was the uh, a few things about Immutable. This the IMX token could be pro maybe, and this is not financial advice. Listen to me, own risk, entertainment purposes only. But the IMX token could be a huge, huge thing in the, in the future. Maybe along the lines of uh, Solana or something like that. But because um, Solana is big on games too. But anyway, let's, let's just talk about it real quick. They've got something called the Passport. And what that does is it ties in all their games. And once you get the Passport, all the games are connected. Just like on the Hive engine, uh, and on the Hive engine you have the Hive token, and then on the uh, Immutable you have the IMX token. Okay, now each game has its own specific token, and then IMX ties them all together, just like the Hive token does on the Hive engine. So anyway, you you want to sign up for this because right now they're giving away pretty much free money just for signing in. On every all the games on their tokens, I've gotten uh, I've only been able to play the the guilds Guardians of the Guild or Guild of the Guardians because I could download that on my phone. Uh, the other game I was interested in playing because of Bronze Dragon was Medieval Empires and, and or Medieval um, Bronze Dragon. If you're listening to this, I need your uh, affiliate link if there is one for this game because if, if I'm going to join it I'm going to join it underneath you hopefully but uh, I can't download this in my game because but well before we show you that just look at all the games I got these are all the playable ones right now and then these are all the ones coming these are all web 3 games guys just like on Hive Engine you can play they're all interchangeable as far as you can bring it and swap it and all that stuff. Uh, but anyway, so let's go. Uh, so you want to, every day, if you have no IMX staked on the platform, you get one gem. Okay? Now, I don't know what the gems are for, but I did come across a YouTuber who claimed that one gem equaled one IMX token. I don't know if that's true, but... I don't care. I'm collecting them. And of course, if you uh, purchase some IMX and hold it or transfer it onto here, you get more gems each day just for having them and logging in. So I just claim some every, every night at 8 o'clock is when it kicks in. You also you get a, a wallet, a passport wallet, so you don't have to have your own wallet. Uh, but from that wallet, you can transfer to Coinbase. It, it, everything's interoperable, okay? So here's the game I can play, but not on my computer, because I got a cheap ass Chromebook. That's all I've got right now. Probably all I'm going to have for the near future. But um, I can play this on my game beautifully, and I've, it, it records uh, on my phone to make a very nice video on YouTube. Okay? And I'm enjoying the game very much. And it's also got its own rewards, which for some reason I can't get into right now. Every time I try to log in, it's just not going in. But if when I get in, I can claim. And right now, I got 90 of its tokens, which is the G token or GOG token, I believe. 
you know, see it just spins. So I don't know, you know, they'll fix that probably in the next few hours here. But um, and then you complete quests just by playing the game. You get Gog. That's all free. Now here's what I'm going to show you: the Gog leaderboard. How many people are actually playing these games? Here's the leaderboard. Okay, that's endless. But I don't know what all that is but that's just you do the endless playing I guess is what it is there's 25 accounts on this page and there's 30,000 pages so that's 750,000 accounts um, I don't know if these games are bot usable maybe they are maybe maybe some of those accounts are bots I don't know that's a lot of accounts a lot a lot of accounts Let's see how many's on this one. 25, 10, and so this one's probably 20. Now that's another 10, so I don't know where the extra 10 comes. So there's 750,000. I don't know if these are all combined or those are three separate accounts. I don't know, but there's a lot of people playing. A lot of people. So here I am on the Medieval Empires but I cannot get it because it only is good for Mac and Windows. All right. Now, uh, Gemini Advanced, I signed up for that, and um, it's Google's uh, version of the AI, you know, chat GTP, I guess. And I've been using it uh, the last few days. I I'm, don't know what to think about it yet. But anyway, I asked it, is Disney in IMX? And it says, Disney is not directly invested in Mutable X, the blockchain platform itself. However, there are several connections between Disney and Immutable X. Disney has released digital collectibles on the VV platform. I already told you that, which is built on Immutable X. Now, VV, which is like 95% Disney, they also are not on any of the Disney platforms, like, you know, uh, Disney Plus, which would be a beautiful place with 250 million followers. Uh, or whatever the number is, um, they just don't advertise it. We don't know why yet, but it's there. Same thing on Immutable X. It's there, but Immutable X does not advertise it. You you really got to you got to go to Immutable Scan to find it. And that's just the data showing what's and, and stuff are selling on Vivi every second of the day. It's it's mad. It's crazy. Um, by the way, if you're on Vivi, they just lowered the withdrawal balance to $100. You no longer need 500 gems to withdraw. Uh, as long as you have 100 in your account, you can withdraw. That was good news for a lot of people. Some people think it's going to drive prices down, but I don't think so. I think it it makes people. It's going to bring people in that the 500 level was scaring away and it's going to it's going to help flippers big time because now they can say well i don't have to make 500 bucks on a flip to withdraw i can only make a hundred and that's doable so I, I i see good things out of that or some people don't anyway game development disney has shown interest in blockchain gaming while no disney games have been announced for mutual x yet several game studios backed by disney have expressed interest in building on Mutable Z. That's a roll-up, the ZK EVM, suggesting potential future collaborations. Disney's logo was featured on the Immutable X website along other major brands. Disney don't just hand out their logo. They just don't. Hinting at possible partnership or collaboration in the future. While these connections suggest a potential for future collaborations, it's important to note that Disney's not made any official announcements true regarding direct investment in Immutable X or developing games specifically on the platform. And then here's some resources. Um, games backed by Disney, Alaba, Alibaba, Google, Square Enix, will be, you know, all the big boys. All the big boys on here. So I'm really starting to think. And now let's go look at the actual token. The price is, you know, $1.71. It's plummeted like everything else has in the last few days. It was just at like three dollars and fifty cents the last month or so, uh, up from a dollar fifty, and now it's down a dollar seventy-eight. I think is what it's at, or whatever it's at right now. But um, it, it's like everything else. It's dollar seventy-three. But here's the thing that I find fascinating: uh, is the 
total supply. Two billion tokens, that's it. Two billion tokens. With, and here's the utility, governance, transaction fees, and staking. Okay, remember, that's just not for one game. That is for all of them. And all of the hundreds and thousands, supposedly, that are coming onto here. There, there's a lot of uses for that token. Where, like, you know, the, the token for this game is only worth what it is in that game, and then you can swap it into something else. IMX is good for all of them, as far as uh, swapping into type thing. So there, there's a lot of usage for it. It's like the, the Hive, uh, Hive token over there on, but that's a very, two billion sounds like a lot, but it's not. Especially with 750,000 people playing one game. Now I'm sure they're the same ones playing the other games, but still, that's that's a a, a great number. Uh, so you're talking maybe I don't know. What makes it unique? It's the ZK Rollup scaling engine with Starkware. Rollups, the 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 transfer fees are nothing, just like on Hive Engine. And then here's where you can buy it. I, I don't know, guys. At the very least, I would keep an eye on IMX. I really do think it's flying under the radar for a lot of people. And um, disclosure, I do own some. Not a whole lot. I got a small bag on it. But I'm keeping an eye on it. I find it very interesting uh, of where this might be going. And I'm also curious how Vivi... Uh, I just don't understand the, why VV isn't being showcased on the platform. Even though it's not a game, it's collecting. They they, they are performing tons of, uh, you know, all the all the collectibles and comics are minted on Immutable X. And, and if you don't aren't aware of VV, VV is the number one NFT platform right now. Has been for. Pretty much the whole time. So anyway, uh, thank you for watching. If you got any comments, please leave below. I make a video that answers all the questions and comments on videos, and I'm due to make one. Uh, if there's a whole lot on a certain subject, I'll make a video just for that to answer the questions. But answers too. If you know anything that I was just talking about and want to add to it, I'd love to hear from it. Um, so. Thank you for watching. I know your time's important and have a nice day.